Hey guys, Emperor here. Um, so we're we're looking at the Destiny Alpha again, and uh, I have started a new character. This is a hunter. Um, the Alpha only allows you to go to level eight, as a uh, as of right now. So I hit that as a warlock. So now we're gonna try out a hunter, see what the hunter is all about. Anyways, uh, let's get moving, shall we? Uh, in my last open world video as my warlock, uh, I did learn that level and gear makes a huge difference. So uh, when I was, I believe, level 4 as a warlock, I ran into some guys that were level 8 and 9, and they were just uh, stomping all over me. And I went back as a level 8, and I, ju I just... been amazing before the collapse. Thousands of humans boarding the colony ships, off to build cities beyond. And now the Fallen, just picking its bones. Sorry, I didn't want to interrupt the, uh, the dialogue there. Um, anyways, uh, I went back, and I just trashed these guys. I mean, uh, they were quite easy. So... I can say that levels and gear makes a very substantial difference. That's the I swear there was one. There it is. Oh, two more. Anyways, I, I can tell you that uh, so far I'm really enjoying this game, uh, despite, uh, th I mean, there's not a whole lot of content in, in the alpha. There's this initial story mission, uh, open world gameplay up to level 8, uh, a level 6 strike mission, which is basically an instanced dungeon with yourself and two other party members, and some PvP. What you mean for for a weekend alpha is is a good amount of stuff to go through, but uh, for people like me that are playing it around the clock, <laughs> uh, went through it pretty fast. So uh, I decided to move on to another class. secondary is. Uh, it's a shotgun, just like my warlock. Okay. I can tell you, as they should be, shotguns are nasty in this game. Uh, you do have to get pretty damn close, but uh... This was one of Skywatch's old array stations, a link to the lunar colony. But uh, if you get within range, shotguns will fuck some shit up. Dead end. Fallen sealed this gate. Guess there's nothing up there. of motion ahead. I've got a bad feeling about this. So it does it does seem like my grenade cooldown is faster on this character. Right off the bat. I swear it takes much longer on my warlock. The high.
By the way, I'm trying not hard not to, but uh, if I cough into the mic, I apologize. <laughs> Got a uh, some pretty bad allergies going on right now. Doing my best to mute my mic or turn my head though. There's a wizard here. You see something floating in the air, you have to kill it. These wizards are straight up bastards, by the way. Uh, take them out as fast as possible. Where'd he go? Uh, I need to finish off his ads first because uh, his shield just regenerates. No point in going after him unless I can lay down consistent damage. Uh, no, there's another one. Alright. Oh, shit. Come on. Suck it, bitch. The hive haven't been on Earth in centuries. That wizard came from the moon. I thought we had them contained there. The darkness could be a lot closer than we think. It's a moon wizard. Dun dun dun. Sorry, <laughs> I couldn't resist. Well, that went a lot faster than it did uh, my first time. So, uh, this is kind of your 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 traveling screen. Uh, you go to set destination here. Uh, so, tower is the hub. Uh, it's where you get you know uh, you can get quests. Uh, there's reputation vendors for gear. Um, regular vendors where you can just buy uh, they stock kind of random items that change every few hours uh, I'm trying to think what else let's see shop vendors uh, oh a bounty board you can pick up bounties which are kind of like uh, make it through a strike mission without dying uh, kill so many titans in pvp matches anyways you complete these objectives and you get uh, a bonus rewards 
uh, mostly experience and I think some kind of reputation, if I remember right. So that's what the tower is. We'll, we'll look at it in a minute. The crucible, this is where your PvP is at. Um, I did a little bit. I saw two different maps, uh, both in the same mode. Uh, I'll probably check that out some more later. Try to get some video of that. And then Old Russia Earth. Uh, we just did The Dark Within. Uh, I believe. Um, I don't know. I, n I never went back to it. I'm assuming that's what we started it on. Uh, and then you have some open world. And later, this icon here will open up for a strike mission. Anyways, we'll go to the tower. Okay, here we are at the tower. Uh, there's what my character looks like unmasked. Updating firmware at earliest convenience. Oh, let's see. Um, so, what have you brought us? Cryptarch uh, identifies loot drops that. Uh, Sometimes you'll get loot that uh, you can't see the stats on. Shall we get started? And uh, he will identify them for you free of charge. What on earth is that? Another hunter brought these back. Take a look. Got a weapon vendor here. Uh, let's see. What am I using? Hmm. I think my glimmer might have uh, carried over from my other character. I don't think I should be starting with 3,469. I'm pretty sure that carried over from my warlock, uh, which is fucking sweet because uh, I'll be able to buy some nice stuff. So let's see here. Uh, sniper rifles are secondary, kind of like uh, uh, where your shotgun goes. So your primary and secondary or I guess they call them special, and then uh, heavies. Um, I think before I buy shit, I'm gonna turn in all my quests here. So down here, oh, these guys are crucible quartermasters. You can, you can, uh, Get like different stuff for the marks you've earned in, in PvP. Like that guy sells speeders and this guy sells uh, gear, I believe. Yeah, level 20 legendary shit. Uh, looks pretty fucking sweet. Yeah. One piece of that has better stats than <laughs> my entire armor on my uh, warlock. Oh, I got. So we got a chess piece here.
for the Warlocks. Strength is for the Titans. So, uh, we'll obviously go with the Discipline one here. Uh, let's put on our, our upgrades real quick and then we'll do a little shopping. Um... Those are the same stats, so this would basically be for aesthetics. I like that other one better. Okay, chest piece, 18, 22, oh, 46, there we go. That's a major upgrade. I'm too fond of that. Yeah, I think I like that one better. 36. Let's uh, put a point in our skill real quick. Summon a flaming pistol which disintegrates enemies with solar light. Hmm. I guess that's cool. All right. Would you see? Now let's see what we can do uh, to make ourselves a little stronger here. State of the art. There. Done. All right, that's as good as our armor is going to get right now. So, oh, actually, I want to go back to that. Uh, we'll rip these other pieces, which uh, essentially just turns them into money. Probably like the salt or the auto better, so I should be out there myself. Alright. Let's uh What stays this clear tonight? Oh, I gotta go to the gunsmith. I guess I should have skipped him earlier. Oh well. That's okay. Uh, by the way, my character is the Awoken uh, race. I swear that's not the color I picked for my face tattoo. It should have been blue. Um, anyways, uh, my Warlock video has a brief glimpse at the character creation, my first one. So uh, if you're interested in that, uh, go take a look at that video. Let's see what we got here. A uh, much better auto rifle. I'll probably go with the auto. Try it. See how it feels. And I think I'd like to try a sniper rifle out. Those are all above level. Looks so we'll take one of those. And keep my shotgun though, just in case uh, I end up wanting to use that after all. Alright, guys, um, let's see what else we got here. Unit 
Titan profile. Looking for something new? Thank you. Looks great. Um, I'm not really sure what the different ships do. I guess uh, maybe better jump ships let you travel farther because it says long range jump ship. Um, maybe you need better jump ships for for better traveling. To, to I know they're going to have different planets and moons and shit to go to, so that's my guess. And then the speeders, I guess just better durability and speed, maybe, I don't know. Take care, Guardian. Requisitions collected. Wiping metadata and returning to Vanguard. Oh, let's see, what else do we need to do? I think that might be it. Yeah, go to orbit. Alright, well, um, that's everything to see in the tower right now. So, uh, uh, my next video is going to be some open world gameplay, but this is going to be the end of this one. I hope you liked it, our first look at the Hunter class here, and I will see you in the next one. Please subscribe, like, share, and comment. Your support is always very much appreciated. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next time.